Hello everyone. It's been quite a while. Um, welcome back to another Let's Play. Uh, as you can probably tell, we're going to be playing Backbone. Um, it's a point and click adventure game and I absolutely love those. There's been some mixed reviews, but I think I might end up liking this. Well, we won't know until we actually play it though. So let's begin. Are you sure you want to start? It, it, yes, I've never played this game before. I literally just inst Yes? Which one's highlighted? Okay, we're off to a great start. I think... Act 1. Prologue. Um... Okay. Uh, you're... Smoking and reading a book in the bathtub? Bonjour? What do you mean you didn't step? Anyways, um, oh, oh, I did not click go. What do you mean? Just enough time to clean up. Clean up what? I didn't see the, the last thing. Use, uh huh. Press E to interact. Oh. Um, I'm using a controller. I think this is that. There we go. Tidy up before my new client arrives. Uh, inspect corkboard. Home to the high and mighty skyscrapers of apes. Big shots and gated communities. They can keep it. Oh. Good place for a nice but expensive date. Museum's fancy. Uh, discovering that it might be difficult to uh, use the controller. I saw the controls and I was like, oh, I only move left and right. Maybe it'd be easier if I used a um, controller. No, I was wrong. Where all the fishing boats hang out? I mean, Mama Helen Lotor taught me everything I know and I've spent years trying to unlearn half of it. Oh... Oh, my diploma project. Places of absolute solitude. Only action my camera sees these days is snapping fools, leaving places they shouldn't be. Ah, no one's idea of paradise. Mainly factories, cramped tenement, blocks full of neglected souls. Ah, Pianetti, you beautiful, dangerous renegade you. Maybe one day you'll settle down and call me again. Huh. That's where the stuff gets made. Doing honest work with your hands. Not a bad life, really. Greenery. Most of our food is grown. The widest open spaces in the city. More restrictions in the public visits every year. Huh. For some reason, this is giving me, um... Very heavy, um... AP human geography vibes. Insurance fraud. Oh, he's talking insurance fraud. Stolen cars. Estranged lovers. Should probably been some of these old case files. I don't know if I want to do that voice. Don't know how long I can do that voice. We'll find the heck out. Inspect desk. Use thing to drag and drop items. Some items can be picked up by pressing E. Pick up the bowl. Uh-huh. Click, drag. Uh huh. Okay. Sure. Get us off this media set. Gotta hit Frankie to fix it when I have cash, so never. Oh, mood. Note on fridge, call mom, buy soap, pay bills, don't die. Oh, I also have don't die on my list. Photochemicals. Leaving photo developers in the kitchen is a sure road to poisoning. Or a great soup. Hmm. The forbidden broth. Hard to get tired of this view. Oh, the cleaning. 
I'll watch these later. Probably not. I feel that. Toilet books. The Great Apes, The Great Story. Swell toilet read. Uh, there isn't much to do in here, is there? Did I finish? Oh. Place chemicals. Everything knows its proper place. Huh. That must be Mrs. Green. Open the door. Hello, madam. Excuse me, I'm looking for Detective Lotor. We spoke on the phone. Uh, at your service, Mrs. Green. How is your day going? Oh, oh, um, truth be told, my back's killing me. Pregnancy puts pressure on the spine, and please, Odette is fine. Um, maybe she'll like if we're friendly? Your first kid? Third, actually. I'm assuming you didn't come to ask about a babysitter. I understand this sort of thing is routine in your line of work. It's about my husband, you see. I'm listening. He hasn't been himself lately, getting home at odd hours, making weird excuses. You suspect he's cheating on you? I think so, but I'd need real proof, right? To go to the court. Um, court, are you filing for divorce? That's right, and above all, I need something damning enough that custody won't even be a question. Your husband will want the kids? I... I can't take any chances anymore. Uh, when did you realize he might be unfaithful? He was always a private kind of man. Now he started getting home late, missing work, and smelling funny. What kind of smell? Like perfume, and not mine. Alcohol, smoke, and something poignant. A kind of herbal stink. Um, I think we've heard enough. Um, ooh, I do want to mention that something I think really neat about this game is that you can set a secondary language and you can switch to it at any time. Uh, I do Spanish because that's the only other language I know. I think it's a cool accessibility feature. Or for someone who wants to learn a language, um, just flip back and forth. Because, um, I didn't know that huele means like. Okay. Huele a perfumes que no son el mío. A perfume and not mine. Let's talk final details. Sure, what do you need to know? What is his full name? Any aliases? Jeremy Green. Hold on. No, it's John and Hank Green. Good. I think people at work call him Jez. What does he look like? Here's a photo. He's an otter, of course. <gasps> oh! Oh, she's an otter! Oh. Otter! I'm half otter. He wears glasses, square ones, and I wear square ones, too. And his wedding band, as far as I know. Oh, and he carries a black briefcase to and from work. Um, have you met any of his friends? No, but he's mentioned a few guys, says they get together after work sometimes. Where would I find him? Usually, I mean. Usually at work or at home. He never used to stop anywhere, now it's all the time. How would I book him out of a crowd? He wears a suit to work. I picked out his green tie and hat for him today. Where does he work? At the Wolf Bank. <laughs> Wolf Bank! On Granville. I'll write the address down for you. That should be enough. That's just a matter of my fee. I can give you a hundred now and fifty when you bring me the photo. Will that suffice? Yes, plus any unexpected expenses. It's not just my life writing on this. I can only afford one shot. What assurance can you give me that you're the right guy for the job? Um, I care about my 
client. Your problems are my problems. Then let me down, Mr. Latour. I trust you with my life. Of course, I'll get right to it. Call you later tonight. Goodbye, Odette. Otter. Okay, what am I doing? Objective? Objective. Track Jeremy Green and find evidence of his infidelity. To Granville. Oh, this is exciting. And music. Oh my god. I think the music was so loud it maxed out the audio. Oh god. Um. Hold on. I don't like messing with the audio settings in the middle of a game, but I might have to. Let's just put the music down a little. Because that caused OBS to be very angry. <laughs> um, okay, but look at the everything as a furry. I agree. I agree with all of this. Granville smells like wet concrete, overpriced food, and puke. My kind of battleground. Oh. Not my preferred place to be. Squirrel! Have you seen? Nah, man, even if I had, why would I tell you? Oh, see you. I didn't expect to get anything from him. Are you a fox? I can't talk. Well, he has headphones on. Of course I can't talk to him. What self-respecting person would bother someone with headphones? Furman and Sons? Oh, no. Hold shift to run. Oh, that's handy. The day I bought a bike... Citizen Maine. Johnny and John. Don't drive. Those, um... I know Citizen Maine is Citizen Kane, but I don't know what Citizen Kane's about. The day I bought a bike? What are these parodies of? Johnny and John? Oh, I don't watch enough movies or know enough about movies. Hi, I love the everything. Look at them all. Look at them. They're cute. Is that a copy bought on a bike? I agree. I might. Let me. Anatoly. Hello, person. Hey, if it isn't Mr. Howie, what a rascal like you up and to on a fine evening like this. Hey, Anatoly, I'm looking for someone. You got a minute? You know, I have a terrible memory for faces, but hey, want to hear a great story? Um, sure. So, my wife Australia and I, bless the shepherd, we got a second lad on the way. Oh, congratulations. Thanks, this is a big one too. Yes, she's friend as a watermelon. Anyway, the story I tell her, ha. Woman, you got any bigger and I wouldn't fit you in the trunk of the car. Huh. Um, don't you think it's kind of mean? And so, haha, ha, he just turns to me with the eyes of a, and of a killer and says, Give me the bread, honey. Oh boy, woman, man. Uh, I have to go. Woman, mysterious creatures, they love bread. No, no. So we break the news to our boy, Victor. Son, we're gonna have a bro soon. Bo broy? Broy? Broy. Bro soon. And he's like, Oh no, bro, what is it? Oh no. What? Hold on a second. So I tell him, Mama Papa worked hard, so the apes let us have another baby. Baby boy. It's just like you. Uh, huh. 
Little Victor, poor soul, starts laughing. Oh, Daddy, we're going to be so happy. Me and Baby Ro will play all the time. And I say, sure, son. Here's to catch. Uh, fine, what's to catch? You and Mama are going to have to look after him because two babies means zero daddies. Because Daddy has to work four shifts instead of two. Ha ha ha. Uh, I got depressing fast. You okay? I'll manage, I'll manage. Now, what did you say you were doing? I'm looking for a guy. Here's a picture. You seen him ever? Yeah, I've seen him. Barrel of less kind of guy. Smells really bad. Take him back from the bite a couple of times. Um. Do you mention anything? Nah, he was too wasted to talk most of the time. This smell did enough talking for both of us, huh? He smelled of. What exactly? Oh, you know, poppy kind of smell. Stale booze and perfume, herbs, awful, awful stuff. An idea where he'd be now? Guess the bite is as good as guess as any. It's a goopy place, though, eh? Thanks, Anatoly. You're detective's best friend. My regards to Estrella. Take care, my man. Bye. Ooh, boy! You know what? Oh, do I want to... Rogue? He did a great job restoring the rogue. If people watched more movies, maybe the world wouldn't be so sad. I should watch more movies. <gasps> Actually, that might be very much in my future. Canines! I'm half wolf. <laughs> Cocktails and movies. Sounds like a great plan for the weekend, actually. Hmm. I'm not a I'm not an alcohol person. And such I don't ever plan to touch the stuff. I can't get over how adorable we look. Poster. Ed and Simons is the hottest new jazz star. See her tonight. Only at the bite. That is not the voice I gave you. That's the voice I gave Anatoly. Oh my god, please go away. Banker. Oh no, are you a lion? Or a cougar? No, panther. You look like a pink panther, so I think you're a panther. Wait, aren't a cougar and a panther the same thing? I'm not all that great with animals. Yeah. Um, you folks work at Wolf Bank, right? Yeah, why? It's just around. And who are you? Um, Wallace. He owes me money. I've been looking for him everywhere. Oh, you and me both, pal. And Derek. Good luck getting it back anytime soon. I make my own luck. When was the last time you saw him? Today, but the wimp left early. He's scared. Derek's gonna split his wig. <laughs> Where do you think he'd be headed? What say you, boys? Home to his nagging of a wife? To the gutter where he belongs? Only apes knows. Um. Uh. Did you boys spend time with him outside work? Yeah, we used to have a blast at the bite every Thursday until he turned into a needy leech. Bite? Could he be there now? How the heck would I know? That's good at Ulrak. Ugh. They, they chose the right abbreviation. I'll do just that. Well, so people at work hate him. Wait, what are you? I can't properly assert- Oh wait, I see your face. Are you a mouse? Oh, oh, I love everyone. Uh, is that? No. When did this, did this game come out before or after Beastars? Because that looks like Jack and the Goshi. I definitely wouldn't fit in with that crowd. Wouldn't want to. <gasps> Fishies! Hold on, sorry, this is very important. Just look at them. Anyways. I love the water droplets. Hello. No entrance for raccoons. Goodbye. Um. <laughs> Understandable. Have a great day. Uh, 
we want to try? Oh, alleyway. Oh, look at look up there. There's someone watching TV. I love the details. Oh, there's so much stuff to look. At. Crouch? Why would I need to crouch? Donnie's on duty in the booth up ahead. I can't deal with him right now. Oh. Let's walk into alleyway. Let's try not to get mugged. Larry! Powered? Well, I'll be damned. It's been a while. Whoa. Larry? The one and only. It's been too long. What's going on, old man? Ugh. Who are you calling old, you old rascal? Ah, right. That's fair. Plus these rags likely don't help my appearance any. Are you okay? Not really. Thank you, though. Now what's your deal? Have you seen an otter guy around here recently? What did he do? Can't tell. Client confidentiality. Must be a shifty guy. What's he like? Um... Here's a photo. I haven't seen him. Sorry. Let me know if you need anything. I'm here often and hear people talk. I gotta leave, but the bouncer won't let me into the bike. Tough break. It's really more of a cat and dog crowd in there. You said you guys an otter? That's weird. Any just how I could get in? What could you do is ask Johnny. He'd know better than me. Who's Johnny? Real kid with a leather jacket. He's a pusher. I don't entirely know what his deal with the bite is, but they're chummy. Why would he help? I take some convincing, but he's chill. I've seen him help cut people cut the line. His clients, I think. What do you know about the bite? Owners of Bloodworth. A lot of rumors floating around about the whole deal. Bloodworth? The bear family? Crime family. Last head of the family up and died. Shh. Hit the fan. Air ended up in prison. Oh. Oh my. And the current owner's relative? Yeah, she's the illegitimate daughter or something. What are the rumors? Oh, all kinds of stuff. How she's got an ape for a lover, or that she was the one who got all the others killed so she could take over. What if stuff Johnny so? Your typical, like, hype and shatterfang. Oh, get this. He started rolling out something called Monkey Butt. Who comes up with these names? It's like they don't want you to do drugs. All right, thank you. We got a Howard. A welcome to Shrekton early. See you soon. Sure, Lally. Thank you. I'll see you. Huh. Neato. Probably don't want to mess with that. Just yet. Soon, but not quite yet. Now, is that person the squirrel over here? Are you Johnny? What voice did I even give him? Who's asking? Um, I am. Yeah, I'm Johnny. What's it to you? I need to get into the bite. Bet you do, pal. Why should I care? You don't usually just say the name of what you want, right? New School Jazz or The Great Upholstery? Um... I know how it works. Word gets around. I just need to help with the dude. Uh, 
Yeah, just do this. And if you're not careful, sorry, I should be reading. Um, but Donnie would love to. Uh, have you seen yourself? Why would I go in? Is that a promise? I have to click it. Oh, how can I earn your trust? Um, about you. If you think, I mean, this is gonna help me. I'm warning you, this is your last chance. I don't want to blow it. Then shut up and buy something. That's not what I'm here for. You, you really don't want to do this. What am I doing, Johnny? I'm making a big mistake. Get me into the fight. That's all I want. You know what? Fine. I don't even care. Let's go. I'll talk to Hank. Thank you. Wow, I confused the heck out of- Oh, Wiggly Pixels! Wiggly Pixels. Oh, that's definitely a shader and I definitely very much agree with it. So, talk to the bouncer. What are you waiting for? Here's Johnny! Oh, hey, Johnny. Oh, you got my favorite customer. Tr Tripper, you can come in. Don't cause any trouble. Uh, thanks. Hopefully I don't die! I confused the heck out of that squirrel, and I think I confused myself. Oh, boy. Jazz alcohol. Beautiful canine ladies. All a little too high end for my taste. Maybe let's not bug every single person that I pop by. That might end badly. Except I'm gonna go back and do it anyways. But, uh, are you a lady? can't tell. Um, well, you're unusual. Sorry? You're unusual means you come with a story. I love a good story. Renee Wilson. Wallace, nice to meet you. Hmm, that's a fake name. You're too young for a Wallace. What's my grandfather's name? So you were named after him. Yeah, you got me, I was lying. That's all, no apology, no repair. You're quite a character. Never met a raccoon before? You're my first. Celebrate sometime. Take my card. Investigative journalist. It's a living, usually. Have you seen an altar gentleman here tonight? I'm sorry, did she just stop talking? Oh, okay. Ooh, there's just singing. Nice kitty. Ingrid. Clarissa. Maybe let's not mess with Hank. I think Hank's on a timer. Listen to music. Are you a bourgeois? Bourgeois? How do you say that? As a programmer and someone who dabbles in game development, I have much curiosity with what's happening here. Oh, it's very pretty. 
there's definitely a lighting engine going on, sort of. That, or there might be pixel marching. Anyway, so I should probably get back up. Oh, I've messed that one up. Hello, Colby. Hey there! You here for Eden Simon's show too? I'm so happy to see her live finally. I'm sorry, it's, it's she's a palm, I have to. Um Uh not quite. I'm actually here running a sort of errand. Well you should hang around for the show. Best performers in the city. Really? Uh maybe I will, but I'm actually looking for someone. Oh, who are you looking for? I'm looking for an otter gentleman. Here's his photo. Let me think. I think I saw someone like that walk in. What was his hat green? Oh, yes, and so was his tie. I thought it was funny. Do you have a briefcase with him? I'm not sure. Sorry. Did you see where he went? He talked to the lady in the jade colored dress and went upstairs, I think. Thanks and enjoyed the show. Wow. Wait, Jade? That looked Jade. That's more of a lapis. Wait, Jade? What color is Jade? I thought it was like a deep green. Like this. Oh, but it can also be kind of blue, which could be either of you two. I'm going to guess you. Um, not yet. My friend's late. I'm worried about him. How touching. They're regular. Jeremy, he's usually here like clockwork. Maybe I've seen him. What's he's like? Green tie, green hat, glasses. Sounds more like you're describing a wanted man. Why are you looking for him? For drinks? You could try asking the bartender or Mrs. Bloodworth. Um, thank you for your time, Miss. Call me Ingrid, Mr. Wallace? Mr. Wallace, I hope we see you again. Goodbye. I should probably be using the um, pseudonym more. Hmm. Oh. My wrist is having a bad time fright now for some reason. I can't even talk to the bartender. You look a little lost. Is it that obvious? It is to me. It's not my usual scene. Then what brings you here tonight? You're not a troublemaker, are you? Do I look like a troublemaker? No, I'm just trying. Do I look like a troublemaker to you? There's an old saying about books on their covers, but you know better than me. Um, well, my cover today is a raccoon in a trench coat. Not too troubling, in my humble opinion. And how should I dress you, Mr. Raccoon? I'm Wallace. Nice to meet you. Pleasure's mine. And what do you do for a living, Wallace? I'm a photographer. Private stuff, mostly. I appreciate creative types. I'm Clarissa Budworth. I own the bite. Oh. Well, let me just say you've got a very cozy place here. Thanks. I do strive to offer a sophisticated experience here. And you excel at it, see. What would you say really stands out here? Folks say that our chef's special is to die for, but I pride myself in everything you're being equally special. So what brought you here tonight? I'm just here to meet a friend. Is that so? More of a regular than you? Sure is. Always talking the place up. What's his name if he's here tonight? I'll know. 
Uh, Jeremy, last name Green. Potter, boring, but nice. You were just meeting him for a quiet drink. Yeah, we got a lot of catching up to do. Darling, I think you're lying to me. Why would I be lying? Mr. Wallace, if that is your real name. Blank boy clearly doesn't suit you. Certainly not appropriate in my establishment. I suggest you take your business elsewhere. I'd rather stay, you know. Well, I must insist, or should I ask Hank? No need. Thank you. Perhaps me and the real you will see each other again. Ah, oh, well, I screwed that up. This is why I'm not a detective. <laughs> or an investigator. Do you like me a good puzzle game? I need to find another way in. Hmm. Just waddle along, waddle along. I don't exist. Waddle along, waddle along. I'm not here. Hello, small child. Are you a mouse? Feeling peckish? I've got sweet and savory. You can mix and match. Make your own trail mix. How about it? Sorry, do you hang around Granville often? I'm here from time to time. Can I help you with anything, sir? Uh, I need to find my way into the bite. You fancy jazz bar? I assume you tried the front door. Got kicked out through the front door. Well, uh, maybe just the back door. I really don't know the place very well. Sorry. You're itching to ask something. Go ahead. Um, why'd you get kicked out, sir? Ah, I didn't like I was snooping around. Why were you snooping around? Um... I'm a private eye working case. Eek! Very cool. What's the case? Um... You know what? He seems very excitable. I'm going to make every single wrong choice in this game. And you're going to have to see it all. I'll let you in if you came into the bite. Sorry, sir. I really wish I could. I would if I could, I swear. But I was being truthful for. I don't know any way in. With a shot. Thanks anyways. Got pumpkin seeds? Of course. Got salted and unsalted. Each bag is worth a half loon, but I'll give you three for a loon. To steal. Just one, is your name really Sid? Yep, short for Sidwell, but no one calls me that. There's a nice ring to it. Sid Seeds. My Aunt Nada insisted on it. Thinks it's cute. Cute and memorable. Thanks for the seeds, I gotta run. I've made one friend. <laughs> oh, there's just so much to look into. Okay. I think... Let us continue investigating next time. I think this was a nice little first episode, especially since I haven't done a video in ages. But um, thank you so much for watching. Uh, as a reminder, I do stream on Twitch. Um, and if you can't make it or it's not really your thing, you prefer videos. I do have a VOD channel, and if you want to talk or get easy access to updates, uh, you can join the Discord. All of those links are available in the description. And if you liked what you saw, please click like, and if you want to see more, subscribe. Have a great day, night, evening, or whatever time it is for you, and I shall see you all next time. Aww.